Hello everyone, this is Tanmud Rahman and today I'm going to talk about trade license in Bangladesh. Now trade license is absolutely mandatory for any sort of business in Bangladesh and you'll have to obtain a trade license for your business from that specific local, local government where your farm is placed. That means if your business has more than one place of business then you'll have to gain trade license from those specific places and from the specific local governments. You will also have to keep in mind that trade license is issued annually, that is, you'll have to renew it every year. And for your trade license, you will also have to submit some government fees, which depends on the type of business that you're doing. Well, if you're a commercial firm, then in six simple steps, I will describe the process for you to get your trade license in Bangladesh. Step number one, you will have to obtain the proper form from the proper office for your specific sort of business. DCC, that is Dhaka City Corporation, have two type of forms for trade license based on the type of your business. Now, a commercial firm must use and fill up the K form. Although all these zonal offices available, that is the 10 zonal offices, use the same K form, you must obtain your K form from your regional office. The officer who is selling the form to you, his sign and his seal will distinguish that it is from that specific zonal office. The price of the form is BDT 10, that is only 10 taka. Step number two. After you're done with the completion of the form, you'll have to submit the form to the local ward commissioner. Step number three. After that, you'll have to collect the license book by the completion of payment of BDD 50, and then you'll have to submit it with other supporting documents to DCCS zonal office. For the K form, you have to provide the rent received from where the business is being operated. And if you own the land, you'll also have to provide the municipal tax payment receipt. The supporting documents will be three copies of passport size photo of the owner, along with the rent receipt or the premises ownership form. Step number four, wait for the inquiry by licensing supervisor, that is the LS. Upon the submission of the form, the LS usually goes to the premises of your business to verify the information that you have provided to them. Step number five, pay the determined fee and collect the trade license. After the LS concludes his or her inspection or the verification of your information and ownership, you will be asked to pay the required predetermined fee and collect your trade license. The fee schedule depends on the business category under which the application was filed. And the final step would be the signboard fee. When collecting the trade license, a signboard fee has to be paid as well. For all type of business, the fees payable for the signboard will be 30% of the exact fee of the trade license.